Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. Okay, Aquarius, this is a reading for you. So let's see what we get for you. Um, oh, there's a feeling of being pulled in different directions and being a feeling of being, um, oh, it's almost like thin, something thin. Okay, Aquarius. Aquarius. Okay, you have got the Queen of the Ocean, and that has to do with abundance. So, and then we've got um, the Angel of the Ocean, which is healing. And then Six of Wands, which is success. So, here's what I feel like is happening. These are awesome cards. These are awesome. So, I feel like that whatever you've been trying to succeed, now, we've got abundance out, so this could have to do with your uh, money, but it doesn't have to be. You know, abundance, I feel like, could, could stem in different directions. So, you know, here's the thing. On the bottom, we've got a wish. Nine of Cups, a wish come true. You know, this is a feeling like um, you are really healing something and you may not even realize it. I mean, this is something major. Um, and it brings you great success. For some of you, this will be to do with money. For others of you, it won't. Here's the thing. You got poised has come out. So, this is a feeling of really knowing how to take things. Really um, leveling yourself out. Really making yourself where you're... you're Oh, you're just, man, it's, it's almost like you just, it just glides off of you. And that's a beautiful, got a beautiful feeling to it. Because it's, it's like it's just going here and it's going there and it just glides off of you. And, you know, it's poised. You're poised. You're poised. You're, you're, you're allowing, but you're healing from as you go forward. And you're having success. This is beautiful. Okay. Let's see. Okay. About money. There you go. You're working hard. And working hard is going to bring you success. It's going to bring you abundance. Oh, yeah, it is. Tried to flip over. So, if this is about money for you, and it's not going to be for everyone, but if it is, you're going to have success. Keep putting in the hard work, you'll have success. Now, if this has to do with um, bringing balance to your life, healing old wounds, bringing balance, healing things that need to be healed, and poising, po bringing poise to your life through balance, it feels like, um, what's going to happen is you're going to go to success. You're going to go towards happiness. Um, you're going to, it, see, this is healing what needs to be healed, but moving towards happiness. You know, breaking old patterns, breaking um, limited belief systems, um, really tiring down. Oh my goodness, sorry. Excuse me. Lord mercy. Breaking down what needs to, to go. And, you know, a lot of it, I feel like you get limited belief systems and that can really limit you. That's what it feels like. So, you're taking what you need and you're leaving behind the rest. And that, that benefits you. Now, okay. If this has to do with um, true love, romance. Ooh, mercy. Okay. Not, no, they're not reversed. Okay. You've got some, okay, here's the thing. <laughs> Here's the thing. Okay. It's like you start seeing what you have to offer. You start seeing yourself. And you see, okay, that's the wish come true, right? That's the Nine of Cups. We already have that, right? Wish come true. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. It's finding it within yourself. And what that does is that leaves you standing very strong, you know, in your own right. Very balanced. Now, people are seeing this. You've got someone that's, they're watching. They got this cup to offer. And, you know, they're watching, they're thinking. 
Um, they're thinking about what they want to do. This person is coming in as the emperor. Um, and it's like, you know, making plans, deciding, you know, what do they want to do about this? Tell me about this emperor energy. Okay. They've got the tower. Tell me. This person has had some real tower moments. And, but what that's done in their life, it's opened them up to a lot. And um, a lot of that is healing. I feel like that you've done healing work and, yeah, see, Eight of Pentacles. This person's on their way to really being what they want to be. They've had something that they freed themselves from. That could be a relationship. doesn't have to be. But it could. So for some of them, they may have become single recently. For others of them, they have really started to, it feels like, um, take their life back in some way. That's what I'm getting. Um, so that doesn't, you know, have to be from a relationship. That could be from a situation in their own life or um, breaking free from something. Now, here's the thing. They have got the Wheel of Fortune They've got the Wheel of Fortune, and then we got the Nine of Cups again. I want you to look at that. That's the Nine of Cups three times, a wish come true. Yeah, yeah. Can't make that up. That is something. That is wild. Here's the thing, the Fool. They want to take a leap of faith on you. They want to take that leap of faith and see where something, you know, where this can go with you. You've done the healing. Do you see what I'm saying with the Hermit? And it shows. You're happy. You're 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 you. You you know, you stand strong in your truth. And that looks awesome. That that is awesome. Um wow. So see this could be for so many different people, but this is beautiful. This is truly um wishes do come true. And you know, that's what this feels like. It's almost like once you start to see, because I'm seeing an illusion. Do we have illusion card anywhere? Because for some reason I'm seeing that word. Yep, right there. Okay. You're starting to see through the blue. And that's what I was seeing is through the blue. It's an illusion. You see what I'm saying? You're seeing through um, like this blue. It's an illusion. You're seeing through the illusion, and that really helps you to move yourself. Just It's almost like you're here, and the next thing you know, you see what you need to see, you heal what you need to heal, and bam, you know, you're no longer stuck in this place of illusion. You see through illusions, and that's beautiful. That is beautiful. Um, let's see. Okay. Can I have some advice going forward for Aquarius? Ace of Cups. Get ready. You know, for those of you that want someone to come into your life, uh, that want a new beginning with love, this is what this is. It comes after, look at the bottom of my coin. Yes, thank you, Spirit. Nine of Cups again. I'm telling you. Yeah, you can't make... See, that bird cage right there, freeing oneself. You have freed yourself. And for those of you that want this romance and this true love, bam. For those of you that don't want that in your life, you're loving yourself. You are going to have what you desire. Because you have brought it to fruition. You have you have earned it. You have done the work. This is beautiful. So my advice going forward is keep a positive attitude and a positive mindset. And know that if you put the work in, you're going to get the rewards. Have faith and trust in what you truly desire. And um, you got it. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful amazing truly this is kind of like that um oh my goodness moment omg moment you know um seriously so that is what i've got for you and it's it's beautiful 
um, do shout out the readings please and give them a thumbs up that helps to grow the channel not to mention I love the comp the comments that y'all put on there and that's awesome and especially you know I've got some some um, of our soul group that goes in there and really straightens other people's crowns and that is amazing that is amazing because that lifts up that lifts people up that you know and we should all lift one another up that's beautiful so um yeah subscribe if you haven't and thank you so much for being here with me i appreciate each and every one of you uh, more than you'll ever ever know much light and love Mwah.